Congratulations. Thank you very much. Yourself, you. 100 wins for your team. A magnificent moment and, and a 41st win for Max. So this, this is, this is a, a moment in history for Red Bull. No, absolutely. I mean, uh, to get a century of uh, victories you know, for, the whole, for the whole team is, is an incredible, incredible achievement. And not, not just here, but for all the people, all the men and women you know, back in the, in the team that put in all the long hours. Um, you know, 100 races is a lot, but 100 wins. As 27% of all the races that we've entered, we've we've won is an incredible, incredible statistic. And 42, 41% of them from one man. Yeah, yeah. I mean, look. I mean, Max has just been sensational this weekend. It was a it was a tricky race for him today because the tire temperature, I think, for all the guys was it was tough out there because it was quite quite cool and the tires weren't in a in a happy window. But uh, wow, I mean, Alex as well. Congrats to him. That was well. I ended up watching as much of his race as <laughs> as our race it was. He had seemed to have half the field behind him. <laughs> Well, congratulations. Um, you guys have just been dominating race after race. So be honest, like what is the goal to win all the races? Do you feel like that's a reasonable expectation level? Well, look, we just take things one race at a time and uh. I don't think you let your, your mind, you know, drift too far into the future. So many things can go wrong. But can you? Do you feel like you really can? Well, can, can, can we? Yes. Will we? Who knows? Um, and because there's so many variables in this game and, uh, you know, we just take things uh, you know, one race at a time, and um, you know the team are doing an incredible job. Max is, sure. is, is you know driving out of his skin as well at the moment. So uh, just collectively, I think the group are doing a, a tremendous job. Congratulations! Um, obviously, we're only nine races in, but you've won them all, <laughs> uh, and it looks like you're going to win many more, as Danica just said. Uh, sometimes you might think about already looking towards next year's car and not bringing so many updates, but with the cost cap. It's, it's more tricky, right? Because you can't yeah. just go and spend lots of money on next year's car. Um, so do you keep developing through this year into next year, or, or how does it work? Well, it's finding that balance. And because, you know, obviously we have a lot less wind tunnel time, uh, we have to apply that. You know, we have to start thinking a lot about next year. So, uh, you know, you're spinning a couple of plates at the moment. But, uh, you know, with the re regulations being stable, whatever you learn this year, you carry into next year as well. So, of course, there are things that we'll still keep bringing to this year's car. but. Yeah, a lot of the focus now back in the factory is is already on next year. Well, congratulations once more from all of us at Sky. And uh, next up, your home race, the One team's of the, home the first race. Of the home yeah. races, yeah. <laughs> we'll take them all. Listen, good Absolutely. luck. We'll see no, you in thank Austria. You very much. Thank Thanks you very much indeed. Yeah. Well done. And if I.